So welcome back, you're joining again with a global. So this time we're gonna talk about Charles Dickens. So uh, about talking Charles Dickens, our content is introduction, his childhood, his parents, his journey towards writing, popular books, death, and the qualities to learn from him all right so as a start let's see who he was charles dickens full name charles john huffman dickens was born on february 7th in 1812 and in his life he had 10 children simply he was a social critic and an English writer that was loved by almost all children in the world. So talking about his childhood. In Charles' childhood, he had to undergo various difficulties, challenges and obstacles. Nevertheless, because of his courage, he became a writer loved by millions of children. Charles Dickens was the second child to be born out of eight children of the family. Their father was a pet clerk in the Navy office. When Charles was at the age of 12, his father, John Dickens, was arrested and was sent to the Marshall Sea Prison in reason for being failed to pay a debt. So talking about his parents, his mother was Elizabeth Dickens and John Dickens was his father. His father John Dickens was born in 1785 and died in 1851. He inspired the character of Mr. Micawber in David Copperfield. Charles Dickens' mother was born in 1789 and died in 1863. She married John Dickens in 1809. She inspired the characters of Mrs. Nickelby in Nicholas Nickelby and Mrs. Micawber in David Copperfield. Uh, the Pickwick Papers was Charles Dickens' first book, which he published. The second novel of Charles Dickens was Oliver Twist, a famous novel. It was initially published in monthly installments that began in February 1837 and ended in April 1839. His third novel was Nicholas Nickelby. He published as a serial between the years of 1838 and 1839, with the book being released in 1839. Bleak House was his fourth novel. So let's see some of his popular books. Oliver Twist, Charles Dickens, David Copperfield, A Tale of Two Cities, A Christmas Carol, Bleak House, Little Demon, and Hard Times. Dombe and Son. So these were famous popular books by Charles Dickens.
So finally we have arrived to his death. The great writer Charles Dickens died on June 9, 1870, and the place where he died was at Gads Hill Place in United Kingdom. On the ground was Dickens' final words. He said this as he experienced a stroke at home. It was a reply to his sister, Georgina, who recommended lying down. There are many, many qualities to be learned from the nobleman Charles Dickens. Some of them are never give up, he had self-confidence, had self-eastern, and also creativity. So this is the end of our video. Thank you for watching and please make sure to subscribe us.